Hello everyone, this is me Sadia here and I'm back with the bonus love read. This reading is going to be for the sign of Capricorn. So Capricorns, let's see what are the love messages of your person? What is it that they want you to know? I will be adding message cards as well in this reading. Plus we will also be adding oracle cards as well. So stay tuned and uh, while I shuffle the cards, let me remind you, it is a general reading. It may, it may not resonate with everyone out there. So always pick the signs and messages that resonates and leave the rest for personal leads you can always reach out to me on my email id in the description box you can also check out other services that i offer as well in the description box so capricorns let's see what is their secret message for you let's begin wow hair fun temperance Three of Wands. They really want you to know that they are stuck with something right now. Some sort of a legal matter maybe. Um, and they really want you to wait on for them. Or if you are the one who is stuck in a situation, they really want you to know that they are waiting for you. And they will be waiting on for you. They are trying to be patient for you. Uh, because they want to be with you. They have other people, other choices as well. But then they are waiting on for you. Um... Let's see more cards here. Queen of Swords, Six of Cups. They really want you to know that they believe that uh, you are their soulmate. And uh, now it can be, you know, vice versa energy as well for some of you. Um, either you are stuck in somewhere or they are. But yes, they really want you to know that they believe that this is a soulmate connection and they are not going to give up on it. So they will be, they are still waiting on for things to unfold, things to happen. Um, let's see some more cards here. They are waiting for some things to change. They are waiting, waiting, waiting. And they are not giving up on this connection that they have with you. They believe that things will change, things will happen. Um, and they really want to wait on for you. This person really believes that you are theirs for sure. I don't know why, but that's what they are believing. Um... They really want you to know that, uh, let's see, for, for some reasons, maybe, you know, if, if you are, um, they do see you as their wish fulfillment. So they are definitely waiting on for you and they really want you to know that. They really seek justice with you. They want you to choose them. They want you to come towards them, leaving everything else behind. They are waiting on for you and they have a strong faith that one day you will come to them. So maybe right now you are not giving this person a chance. Um, but be mindful, the energies could be reversed because for some reasons I'm picking up like, you know, it can be exactly the opposite for some of you. Maybe it's the energy of you yourself and that's the, the energy that I'm picking up is going to be the energy of the person that you are dealing with. But I feel like you know, they really want you to know that um, you are theirs and they will make it happen. So maybe there is a specific someone that you are in love with and you do see that person as your soulmate and maybe that person is not giving into this connection and you have a strong faith around it where you feel that you know this person is all yours. Um, but whatever the scenario is, they are waiting. Um, and things will change let me see underneath the deck we do have the knight of swords underneath that we do have the five of pentacles right now seems like you know the situation is not in the favor of this connection right now but soon it will be i feel like you know whatever it is that is stopping this connection from moving forward it, it has something to do with the two things one justice second another person another situation or third party situation one thing or it can be a situation that they have they are dealing with as well like you know maybe there is some legal matters to get sorted before they could come with you so that could be the case for some of you but yes this person really believes in this connection they really don't uh, want to give up on the connection that they have with you so let's see what else do they want you to know what are their messages for you let's see what do they want you to know you don't know how hard it was to let you go. In that situation, I feel like you know maybe they have um, allowed you to take your time to decide 
and uh, get done with this justice situation or the hair fan situation there and they are waiting on for you to come back to them they have allowed you to do whatever you wanted to do and now they are waiting patiently to be on the receiving end of uh, some message communication coming from your end because they do they they believe that it is um uh they they believe that this connection is meant to happen um the connection that they have for you with you they believe is a very strong connection so they you know even if they have allowed you to go it doesn't mean that they have given up on this connection um i wonder if you are happy without me so for some of you maybe your person is waiting on for you know if they had a if they had allowed you to move on now they wonder if you're happy without them or not because they somehow believe that you will be coming back to them maybe they allowed you to marry someone else and now they they are kind of you know um upset with that because they really want to know if you are really really excited and happy without them or not i still love you unconditionally they really want you to know that they still love you have you moved on uh, from them? I, I wonder because I feel like, you know, maybe they have told you to go away. They might have, um, you know, said that to you, but now they regret that. Don't you ever leave me. Deep down, they don't want you to leave them, but maybe they have had this, uh, you know, if you are dealing with a person who was after you, who was chasing you, who was like, you know, doing all to, to convince you to marry them. And then you didn't give them anything and now since they are gone maybe you know you are the one who uh, who doesn't want them to leave you you know even though you were kind of you know rude to them but that and then you don't want them to leave you it can be that situation for some of you as well so it can go vice versa because this is a general read so cross watchers would be also watching it so maybe for some reasons it could be their energy as well do you love me the way I do? So this person really wonders at times that if you love them the way they do love you or not. Let's see more messages from your person. I am trying to work on my mental blocks. So this person really wants you to know that they do have mental blocks around this connection. I feel like, you know, what, what I pick up most of uh, this read is there has been a situation in this connection where one person was chasing the other person to give into this connection, begging the other person to give into this connection then the one who was chasing begging chose to walk away and then the person who was being chased is not gonna like it so it's it's more like you know now they say that i believe this is a soulmate connection as well you know as the other person believed maybe we are so different but maybe we could still make it happen so now this person is going to understand that yes we can still make it happen like you know it doesn't matter whether we are you know same or different we can still make the things work so i feel like you know there is this uh, strong connection and a bond that you have for each other and i feel like you know your souls are already tied to each other whoever it is that you're dealing with finances and career um financial issues are a factor in your love life right now for some of you your financial situation could be the reason why you are not together um maybe somebody had uh, chosen there, you know, maybe because of the work scenario, somebody was not giving into the connection and the other person chose to pull away and wait for the other person. So it can be that for some of you as well. But I feel like, you know, one person has been begging for attention, but they didn't get it. And now they chose to, you know, uh, pull away. And that's something which the other person is not liking. It be that you owe them. So that's pretty much it coming up for you for this read. If it helped you, do like, share and subscribe. Till I do the next reading for you guys. Take care. Bye.